Hi everybody. I thought that this was interesting so I wanted to share it with you. I was reading an article that was translated. It is a Russian article that I got from this site which I did want to post a video on and I'm going to post it now. It is on the website End Times Prophecy. For those who have difficulty with any kind of religion, please put that aside. It is the information that is really important. And because I know that a lot of people have barriers in their mind, their filters, that when they see certain words, when they realize that it's a site that is religious. It doesn't matter what religion it is. They just get turned off. And I spent time looking for another site that had a list that is rather extensive but current of mass animal deaths that are occurring. And this is the only site, so I want to thank End Times Prophecy for posting this information, it is very, very important. Mass animal deaths for 2017. So I'm reading this list. I also realized every other site that had lists, they were not current and they didn't link to actual articles about these deaths. So I really appreciate they taking the time to post links. So. 400 dead turtles found floating off the coast of El Salvador. A mass die-off of fish washes ashore in Mexico. And the dates are here, November 5th, just uh, five days ago. On the 2nd, these turtles died um, or were found dead. On November 2nd, thousands of fish died in India. On October 31st, 132 dead seals wash up on the shores of uh, a lake in Russia. So I clicked on the link. It brought me to an already translated article. But I noticed at the top it said review Google privacy terms. So I clicked on it and I got this, a privacy reminder from Google. Now. Google invades our privacy, but I guess we have to respect the privacy of others. Google does not respect ours, but we have to abide by Google's terms. Um, so I didn't even look at this. I wanted all of us to look at it together. Scroll down and click I agree when you're ready to continue or explore other options on this page. To be consistent with data protection laws, we're asking you to take a moment to review key points of Google's privacy policy. This isn't about a change we've made. It's just a chance to review some key points. As if we have privacy protection laws. Those laws were passed so that we have to abide by them. Major corporations like Google do not, nor does our government have to abide by any privacy laws. It's just for the peons of the world. But when you search for a restaurant on Google Maps or watch a video on YouTube, for example, we process information about that activity, including information like the video you watched. <laughs> device IDs, IP addresses, cookie data, and location. So they're putting it in our face that they are watching everything that we do. What privacy do we have? We don't. We also process the kinds of information described above, above when you use apps or sites that use Google services like ads, analytics, and the YouTube video player. You know, I got a comment from a subscriber who never leaves comments, but wanted to leave a comment underneath a video that I recently posted 
and I have been screen capturing some comments because I want to make a video responding to some comments and that was one of them so that comment this person said that I don't leave comments I'm writing this comment uh, asking what I thought people needed to do but I'm gonna get into that in another video and I thought it was interesting because the person said that they would be taking down their comment because they don't want to get on the radar understand this everybody who is on a computer is on the radar you don't even have to get on to the internet if you have a computer they have back doors and it's not just a back door into uh, the internet it's a back door to everything offline online so everybody's on the radar whether you leave comments or not so you may as well take advantage of just leaving comments but I guess people don't want the particulars of uh, what they say to be collected and stored in the big data bank perhaps that's it every video that you watch on YouTube is already being collected stored saved for any time they want to use it against you if they have to that's the world that we are living in today and Google is controlling it all and it's amazing to me that people actually can say that Google is a private corporation it is not now private corporations that were monopolies we used to break them up we don't break them up why why has our government allowed Google to monopolize the information on the internet because it's not a private corporation it is government it is big brother so they go on to say why we process it why do you process that information Google we process this data for the purposes described in our policy including to help our services deliver more useful customized content such as more relevant search results I would prefer to just do searches without Google giving me information that it thinks I may want I can myself very easily ignore the information that I don't want and go to the information that I do want instead of Google deciding for me but that is how Google works but they also process it to improve the quality of our services and develop new ones deliver ads based on your interests I don't want that including things like searches you've done or videos you've watched on YouTube that's right videos you've watched on YouTube unbelievable improve security by protecting against fraud and abuse and conduct analytics and measurements to understand how our services are used we also combine data among our services and across your devices for these purposes for example we use data from trillions of search queries to build spell correction models that we use across all of our services and we combine data to alert you and other users to potential security risk you know we'd be a lot smarter if we didn't have these automatic um, spell corrections if we actually had to look in a dictionary to learn how to spell words anyway um, so if you sign into your Google account before agreeing we'll remember your choice across all of your signed in devices and browsers so I don't know I, I've not been signed in because this is uh, my email related to Kafka Winston world yes you get you get thrown off of one of Google products and it screws up all of the products that it has coordinated for you so my Gmail got screwed up Google Plus the page that I was leaving all of uh, the articles links to articles I no longer have access to that very very frustrating but um, 
I don't agree. So, there. Um, let me just, you know, these seals that died in Russia, they don't know why. Preliminary tests ruled out any kind of disease. But I thought it was interesting that down here, and I can't get to any of these articles. If you're signed in, I bet you could. But this was posted on the 31st of October. And they have not determined the cause of death. 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 So, 90 seals dead in one area. They ruled out any kind of infection, or it's not yet confirmed. The first samples gave a negative result. Poacher shooting was excluded. No bullet holes. No signs of disease. On the 30th, this site had an article cause, uh, uh, called The Cause of Death, Cardiac Arrest. Cardiac Arrest. <clears throat> now, we all know that these uh, microwave frequencies, millimeter wave frequencies, our militaries using sonic weapons in our oceans. Yeah, scientists say it's a mystery. It's a mystery. It's a mystery. They are killing, killing so much life with these weapons. They don't care. Whales, dolphins, seals, doesn't matter. But let's just go through this link. And by the way, where did I find this website? I found it on um, Chemtrail Planet. So I am recommending again that people bookmark this site because right up here are all of the pages on Chemtrail Planet and there is a tremendous amount of information. You go to Animal Deaths and that is where you can find the link to that list. But Chemtrail Research, Cloud Types, um, chemtrail songs, military and government, dying trees, declassified black operations, which is where I was doing some research, um, strange rain, articles, patents, vaccines, Monsanto, whistleblowers, gun control, EPA, Agenda 21. It's not just chemtrails. So it is loaded with a tremendous amount of information. And let's just stick with uh, the mass deaths. So 70,000 fish die in a lake in India on the 31st of October. Remember, the 2nd of November, thousands of fish died in another lake in India due to pollution. Uh, on October 30th, large die-off of fish in Cyprus. 48,000 birds killed due to avian flu in Dominican Republic. Thousands of dead fish appear in river in Spain. Fish die in fish farm in Indonesia. Schools of dead fish wash up Sydney, Australia. 10,000 birds dead due to avian flu, Bulgaria, thousands of dead fish in river in Pakistan, 80 plus seabirds, Australia, 125,000 salmon die in Scotland, thousands of penguin chicks die of starvation, East Antarctica, tons of dead fish wash up on beach in Thailand, 30,000 birds killed due to avian flu in China, 5,000 dead fish in India, 41,000 birds killed due to avian flu. In Netherlands, thousands of dead fish found in river in Paraguay. 80 tons of fish died due to flooding. 
in Vietnam, hundreds of cattle dead due to wildfires in Portugal, 103 dead whales washed up this year, never been so many before in Brazil, five pilot whales dead, stranded, Hawaii, large die-off, Australia, tens of thousands, jellyfish, New Zealand. The, the, the list is very long. 80 or 800,000 plus birds killed avian flu. Italy, 4,000 pigs drowned after flooding. Vietnam, thousands of dead fish. Israel, three dead dolphins, two dead whales wash ashore. New Jersey, hundreds of dead fish. Italy, 100 plus hippos dead from outbreak of disease. Nambia. Hundreds of seagulls die. Spain. Millions of fish die due to pollution. India. Thousands of sharks and other marine life mysteriously dying in San Francisco, October 5. 34 tons of fish died. Vietnam. Thousands of dead fish found washed ashore. Lake in Kentucky, America. October 5th. Massive die off of fish, Brazil. Thousands of dead fish and marine animals washing up along the coast of India. 10 million birds dead, avian flu, South Africa. Yeah, and it goes on. Thousands of dead fish washing ashore in a creek in Maryland, America. That's September 30th. So, since most of my subscribers are American, 1,000 deer dead due to outbreak in, of disease in Pennsylvania, Second, uh, 22nd of September. 47 dead dolphins washed up this year, scientists concerned, along Gulf Coast of America, 21st of September. Thousands of dead fish found in a canal in Florida, America, 20th of September. Hundreds of fish have died in Lake in Ohio, 18th of September. 20, uh, 201 whales and dolphins washed up this year. Record breaking number in Ireland. Hundreds of pink flamingos dead from Hurricane Irma in Cuba. 800 plus dead seabirds found on island in the Bering Sea. This is heartbreaking. Hundreds, possibly thousands. Hundreds, possibly thousands. They don't know how many of cattle dead from storm in Texas on September 9. Harvey. The list goes on. It's very long. Dozens of dead dolphins and turtles are washing up on the Gulf Coast of America. August 18th. Thousands of dead fish washing ashore along Tampa Bay Coast. August 17th. The 12th right whale found dead in Massachusetts. August 9. Dozens of sea lions washing up. 31 dead, California. Many hundreds of dead fish wash up in Orange Beach. Mass die off of fish in the lake in California. Thousands of dead fish found in the waters of Western Lake Estates, Texas. Sorry for all of the noise outside. Hundreds of dead fish wash up in Clear Lake, California. Hundreds of dead birds line a road in Idaho. Hundreds of dead fish found in Colorado. Thousands of red ca uh, crabs wash up. California. Thousands of cattle die in heat wave in California. July 6th. 
alarming number of dead fish wash up in Lake in Ohio, July 5th. Thousands of dead fish wash up in Lake in Wisconsin. Thousands of dead fish washing up in Lake in Minnesota, all on July 5th. Dozens of dead seagulls found washed up on a beach in Buffalo, June 27th. Hundreds of dead water rodents wash ashore in Mississippi. Thousands of dead fish found washed up in Brunswick Bays, June 18th. Hundreds of dead seagulls found along a road in Detroit. Hundreds of dead fish wash up in a lake in Ohio on June 15th. Massive amount of fish mysteriously washing up dead along the coast in Texas, June 14. Thousands of dead fish found in the, a river in Texas, June 5. Massive die off of fish in Puget Sound in Washington, June 5. You think we have a problem? You think our countries have become a little bit too toxic? Too evil? Die off of seabirds along the coast of Florida, May 18. Hundreds of leopard sharks washing up dead in San Francisco Bay. 10,000 cattle dead due to rare spring snowstorm in Colorado. 10,000 cattle dead due to a snowstorm. Hundreds of migratory birds found dead in Texas. Hundreds of dead fish wash up in River in New Jersey. May 3rd, the others May 4th. 12 turtles found dead, a mystery in a park in Queens, New York. Massive die-off of deer, newborns, and female deer this winter, catastrophic in Wyoming, April 29. Thousands of dead fish are washing up in Petersburg, St. Petersburg in Florida, April 26. Hundreds of seabirds washing up dead on, or dying in Santa Barbara, April 25. Thousands of dead fish turn up in a lake in Georgia, April 23. Dozens of dead or dying sea, sea lions, seas, dolphins, and seabirds washing up along Southern Cal uh, California, April 21. Massive or masses of Asian carp are dying off, unknown reason in Kentucky. Thousands of dead fish, Michigan. Thousands of dead fish, Chicago. Hundreds of dead fish found in a creek in Wichita, April 16. Hundreds of dead fish mystery in Jackson, Tennessee. Thousands of bats still dying off. Missouri, April 13. Countless numbers of blue villella wash ashore in Oregon. April 9, thousands of dead fish found along a lakefront in Chicago, April 6. Thousands of birds are dying in Atlanta, April 4. 18,000 birds killed due to avian flu in Georgia, March 27. 22,000 birds killed due to avian flu in Kentucky. 30,000 dead fish found in a lake in Idaho. March 22nd, the birds. March 21, the fish. Thousands of cattle dead due from wildfires in Kansas, March 9. Hundreds of cattle dead from wildfires on the plains of Colorado, March 8. Several dead leopard sharks found dead beach, California, March 8. 
tens of thousands of birds killed due to avian flu, Tennessee. 4,200 water birds do, dead due to avian um, cholera in Idaho. Four dead whales dead in Virginia. Uh, off the coast. Um, or washed ashore. February 28th. A lot of this has to do with these weapons, silent weapons of mass destruction, whether sonic or microwave or cell phone towers or all of the toxins, all of the diseases that, yes, they are unleashing. Owls dozens found along a road in Idaho. That, that, you know, we're going to find no reason for this, no doubt. Yeah, just showing up along I-84. It's like they fell from the sky. And what could make that happen? Microwave frequencies. Let's see. Do they have any clue? It's not a terribly uncommon occurrence. Well, today it is not terribly uncommon. Today, with all of the genocidal, psychopathic, crazy, unbelievably evil people who are using this technology it's 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 overwhelming and I know that a lot of people can report on this and just kind of you know talk you know sounding very eloquent as they report, but I can. But I can. Because I know, I know the reasons behind this. These frequencies are incredibly dangerous. And once they zap, and these birds get hit with it, their brain's so small, well, they could have cardiac arrest, or they could literally fry their brains and drop from the sky. So if you're interested in uh, staying abreast of how many mass die-offs have occurred, I suggest that you bookmark this site. And there's also another site that um, if it comes up, okay, here, wildlife health information. And unfortunately, my computer is really getting very bad, but I will link below to this. This is a map that has an awful lot of information. It's supposed to be a map. It should be coming up, but it's not going to come up. All right. Um, maybe refresh the page. Let's see. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. How many of you are having computer problems? All right, it's not coming up. Um, <laughs> I can't even. Come on, open. All right, just a few minutes ago before I started this, it was a map. It was a map. So. Now it's not a map. All right. Um, 
I will link below to this. This is a map of the United States and it has circles with numbers and you click on the circle and you can find out regarding birds and fish any mass die off. And it was very interesting when I had it here in this video. I decided to pause you and wait a few minutes because I wanted to see if it would finally appear and it did. So this is your map and these are the circles and what you can do. I don't know how updated it is, but let's see. Um, Ohio here. We've got 47 dead mallards, unidentified fish, great blue heron, uh, botulism. And you can click on here and read more information about the event, but it's interesting that this is our government site and they're not disclosing all that much information. Um, so this was a botulism mass death. They had two great blue herons die and 15 dead and 27 mallards died but if you continue on you will see that there have been massive die-offs that's 8, 23 interesting now the site has wiped off most of what was here. You had an awful lot in Washington and there were circles all over this map and suddenly those circles are gone. <laughs> there, there were circles all over. Now it's gone. There were a lot of circles of um, geese dying in Virginia and I had to wonder if that was the killing off of geese. I posted a video on that. In Boston they were killing geese purposely because mm, the community members were getting upset and geese, geese uh, poop so they didn't want the poop around. So what do we do? We kill them and that video that I posted on Kafka Winston World they were killing these geese and saving the meat for the homeless. Wow. Maine you had 50 uh, herrings that died. So I will link below. Um, it looks like they have scrubbed this map. Jesus. Well, get whatever information that you can on whatever site you can and if it's the truth, you know, circulate.